Yo, what's up guys? Today I want to show you how to remove and replace your mirrors on your Piaggio or Vespa scooter. So jumping right into it, we have this little rubber seal here. We're going to lift that up. What we're going to need is a 17 millimeter wrench or a monkey wrench that's adjustable. What we're going to do is we're going to place that right around the 17 millimeter sleeve here. And on the right mirror, we're going to get it nice and tight there. We're going to crank it counterclockwise to loosen it. And then for the mirror, we're going to rotate it counterclockwise until it pops right off there. Previous owner did this a little too hard with the wrench and they broke the plastic right over there which is annoying. So this comes, it takes a second, we'll speed this up. All right, so now we've got it off. On the right mirror, you see the sleeve. Uh, so this comes all the way off if you wanted to. All right, so what we're gonna do, you can see the design here. Now sometimes what happens is these threads can break. What happened on the left mirror, it's threaded opposite. I wound up snapping it off on the left side mirror here, but we'll get to that in a second. So to retighten it, what we're gonna do is get the sleeve. We're going to rotate it, get it close to the top. We're going clockwise, so close to the top there. We're gonna line it up again, and I can show you what we're dealing with in here. You can see how the previous owner snapped it and then let's try to get this back here let's get this steady there we are so what we're gonna do we're gonna place it right back on there and this time we're going clockwise to get it back home and then we're going to keep rotating this clockwise until we get the tension to where it stops wherever that is I'll show you let's see so, almost there. So it stops right here. All right, so we don't obviously don't want the mirror in this position. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna back it up to where we want it, or somewhere right above the handle uh, grip here. And then, with this extra little sleeve down here, so what we can do is we can use our fingers, we're gonna get it as much as we can clockwise to where it's tight, where we like it. All right, and now we get our monkey wrench again we're gonna keep it in the position that we like. We're gonna hold it with our left hand and then we're gonna tighten that little sleeve, that little nut down there. Give it a little give. Hold on tight. One, give it a one, two, two. Don't snap the plastic like the previous guy did. And then now we just put our sleeve right back down. All right, real easy for uh, the right side here. As far as the left side, uh, this is where it gets a little tricky. So the left side is threaded in reverse, all right? So same story, we're gonna lift up the little rubber tab here, and you can see how I'm actually missing the uh, 17 millimeter hexagon sleeve. Uh, long story short, I wound up breaking uh, the mirror before this, trying to take it off. So I want you to learn from my mistakes, all right? If you can imagine the sleeve is on here, we got our monkey wrench. To loosen it up, we are going to go clockwise, all right? Clockwise to loosen up that hexagon and then to get the actual mirror off, we are going counterclockwise. Take a note of that and write it down because you don't want to break it off like I did. All right. These, the left mirrors are reverse threaded. So long story short, it's not difficult. Just take your time. Make sure you do it correct the first time so you don't break anything and then wind up having pieces of old mirror lodged in there. And also make sure you take your time and you don't break off the plastic like the previous uh, owner did when they tried to loosen up their mirror. Anyways guys, I hope this helped out. Please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. I will catch you later. Bye.